Yeah, so um, I'm Maria, and my daughter Isabella started last year in grade nine. Um, we left a busy city and looking forward to slowing things down from a traditional high school. And we walked the campus with Dave Crocker and yes. fell in love. I, I think even at one point took my shoes off when we got to the lake and uh, this was first meeting and just felt very comfortable. The energy um, on the campus just, you just instantly felt relaxed and I knew my daughter would love it and feel safe. Um, actually, it started with her, um, my other daughter, uh, who left a busy, a busy high school where students are just more or less kind of getting a little lost um, and getting a little tougher, the, school, the high school is there. And so I think she listened to her older sister saying that the schools are just not as easy and fun and, um, and then we were looking more for like a safer direction. Um, so this, as you know, like with schools, it's all about class sizes and smaller class sizes and more one-on-one -on -one with the teachers. And so we definitely had all those boxes checked off at our LC, like, mm -hmm. absolutely. She loves the environment, um, and the overall, um, I think just the close-knit, smaller size, everyone, they, you know, in the, even in the girls' locker room, it's more like a friend's cafe um, than, you know, changing your in and out. It's, it's very just people chill and relax. And um, I think she likes that the teachers are very understanding. So if, you know, if you're not feeling well one day, um, if you need time, extra time to do a homework assignment, it's very easy to just find that, um, understanding. So Isabella um, started uh, enriched math and um, English. She found the enriched um, math. She, she could keep up but she just felt like I think I'll just stick with the regular. So to have that offered, to know that you can push yourself to the limits and she could, you know, to have that um, extra work available, you can, there's there's no ceiling like you can go as far as you want or um, dial back if something is you know a little challenging so to have that option academically is perfect mm -hmm. um, I, I feel that you know from day one um, the just the overall um, the teachers walk up to you. It's not, in a traditional school, you're scheduling a time, a phone call, um, you know, a meeting to, to, you know, to get in touch with that teacher. And it's, you know, it's, it's rushed. It's very rushed um, to have one-on-one. -on -one. Whereas at ROC, when you see a teacher, you can stop them and you don't feel like you're taking them from anything. You can have a full conversation um, about, um, about anything. So I, I find the teachers to be very understanding, accommodating, and you don't ever feel like you're taking up any of their time or inconveniencing them. So that's a huge bonus, and it's always been consistent like that. And mm -hmm. um, yeah, just wonderful. Oh, how much time do we have? Um, from definitely from the the environment um i love the activities there's always something being planned um from the fall colors and they don't it's always families like they don't just include um the students and you know they're they're wanting and urging family members and grandparents and and visitors to come and to walk the campus and there's always opportunities and I love that ROC always has something planned like there's always an activity um, a sports game they encourage um, bring your own cowbells and we're cheering on our team and it's been such a rich success I want to say just the this it's its own community it really has um, a little bit of everything which for a school um, I find like you have the, you have the ac academics um, and you have the strong athletics, which is 
phenomenal, which is great. And then you have, I want to say the restaurant, you've got the cafeteria, you have the, the school store, which, you know, has all the spirit wear um, from, and from spirit wear clothing to pens and calculators. And so for boarding students as well, like you don't feel, um, you know, oh, I wish I had this. And I, I look at the school and I look around, I'm like, okay, what else do we need? We have a beautiful waterfront. We have all these, you know, little, I want to say, you know, every building makes up this beautiful community. If you're thinking about RLC, um, don't wait any longer to come and look at the, look at the campus talk to you can stop anyone that you see and don't wait any longer just plan a trip come out and um, you'll be welcomed